Hey kindergarten penguins, Miss Clayton here. And today for the 26 letter countdown, I have the letter L. See, L is for limbo. So I'm gonna teach you how you can limbo at home today. Let's go. All right, kindergartners, I have my assistant here, Miss Kelsey, and you might recognize her from F day um, I'm going to teach you how to limbo so you need something that you can hold up and go underneath so you're going to make sure you can get real flexible and you're going to move your body under the limbo stick <laughs> so then you are going to ask the person that is helping you to lower your limbo stick and see just how low you can go <laughs> And they're gonna continue to do that and see how low you can go. So friends, you are going to want to make sure that you do not touch the ground when you're limboing. That is an automatic out. So there are many things around your house you can use. You saw that I used paper. Let's see what else we can use. See, what are some other things you can use around your house? You can use a broom. Okay. You just hold it up. Or you can use a hose if you have two people holding both sides. Perfect. Um, How about a rake? A rake would work just like a broom. Great. And we want to make sure that we're being safe with our household objects, right? Right. We're not going to poke each other. Perfect. Awesome job. Make sure to send me pictures of how low you can go. See you later, penguins.